Welcome to day 25 of my Get Uncomfortable Challenge. Um, I just got home from the gym, so I'm going to make this short and sweet because I'm starving and I cannot wait to eat and my food's already ready and warm for me inside thanks to my amazing, loving wife-to-be. Um, so I can barely even focus right now. But <laughs> uh, I wanted to share with you that today I did uh, something very, 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 very uncomfortable for me. Um, I attempted some handstands and... I have this crazy, weird, just indescribable fear of being upside down. Um, it's I've always had it. I also have vertigo, so that doesn't really help. Um, so I get really nauseous, um, super lightheaded and dizzy from being upside down, even for short periods of time. So it's really hard for me to even, even if I do them against the wall, it's difficult because I just, I feel sick almost immediately. Um, and when I come down from them, I, I need like a good 30 seconds to recover, if not several minutes. Um, so it's it's a challenge, and I don't know if um, doing them more often will, you know, help with the vertigo. It doesn't seem to have had any effect. Um, I don't practice them very regularly, so I can't really say for sure right now. Um, but anyways, I did them, and I fell. And, you know that's the worst that can happen. You fall. And it doesn't mean that I failed. I don't feel like it was like, I'm not sad. I'm not like, oh shit, that sucked. Like, oh my God, I'm never going to do that again. Um, it was actually a good thing because I got out of my head and I was just like, get your legs up there and just try, you know? So I did and I fell and it's okay. I'm alive. I didn't break anything. Um, I'm actually you know, much more likely to give it another go because now I know what it feels like and, um, you know, I have that, that feeling in my body of the familiarity of it. So I'm not like as resistant as I was before. And that, to me, that's a success. Um, it's also a success because I have no intention of not doing it again just because I fell. Um, you fall all the time and it's not a big deal. Um, so, you know, it's that whole tried and true saying about picking yourself back up. It's, it's definitely the truth. Um, you're going to fall a lot of times and it doesn't mean that you are, you know, that you did anything wrong or that you're a failure or that you're not strong or that anything negative about you, it says nothing bad about you. Um, it's just part of the process of learning and growing and doing different things and being uncomfortable. It's the whole point. So, um, yeah, I'm excited about it, and I had a good workout, so I feel a lot better, especially compared to yesterday. I was, whoo, that was rough. <laughs> that was really rough. Um, I, it's funny, because a lot of you guys noticed in the video, and I got a lot of personal messages and texts and things from that, so I appreciate that. Um, you don't have to worry about me. It was, you know, I'm human too, so you may not see me struggling a lot and, and talking about those kinds of things, but I go through shit just like everybody else does and I struggle sometimes too. Um, it is rare for me to have like uh, moments of being down and sad but of course it happens so um, anyways it's you know it was one of those days and that's okay and I, I'm grateful for days like that because it reminds me um, of why I do what I do and um, how far I've come as a person and, and how grateful I am for my life right now. So I wouldn't change anything um, about any day that I've ever lived in my life. It's it's made me who I am today and I love myself. So, you know, it, you can't get any better than that. Um, anyways, yes, day 25, going to eat and I will see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching.